What's up, everybody? It's Normally Retro, and of course, I run Rise From Your Grave. And right now, I'm just going to look over the top five favorite quotes, uh, at least up to now. I mean, I have millions of quotes that I love from all these games. But right now, these are some of my favorite ones that I have on the site. And honestly, these are probably top five of uh, all time for me. Anyway, let's get going to it. Okay! Yeah, honestly, I love that from the moment I first heard it. Like, I remember uh, seeing it in the arcade when I first saw Fatal Fury, actually, in the Neo Geo. And uh, I saw him throw his hat up and go, okay. But honestly, the reason I thought it was so dope is because for the longest time, I thought he was saying, funky. But <laughs> it's okay that he doesn't. I mean, cool. Okay is good, too. Stop talking nonsense. I know nothing. It's Bob, the boss. She isn't the one you guys are looking for. <laughs> Bob, I know nothing. <laughs> All right, I'm, I don't even really know what to say about this one. I love this. Me and my friend, we repeat this quote all the time. Like when we used to play uh, Special uh, Criminal Investigation in the arcade, we, <laughs> we would always start laughing when we see this part because it's just so weird. It's like, why is he saying, why does he repeat himself saying, I know nothing? And also... It's even weirder in the game because <laughs> they're stopping all these dudes and they uh like these criminals who are getting arrested for like kidnapping and like terrible charges are just saying, hey. Buddy, you did it again. I ain't Bob. This little girl ain't the one either. I guess Bob is somewhere over the mountain, you dummy. You didn't get him this time. And they for some reason they both know about the kidnapped girl and the fact that you didn't catch him. <laughs> it's just really strange. I don't know. You've got a lot to run before you beat me. Try again, kid. <laughs> now, this one from Street Fighter is just classic. I mean, I don't even know where to begin on this. I, this is another one that I quote all the time. It sounds weird. It's like, it sounds like a drunk Dracula or something. I don't know. Just something, some sort of inebriation is going on while he's reading this. I'm telling you, because it just sounds way too weird. And then he tries to have that laugh at the end it just does not come off right but i mean still it's beautiful Warriors, show some guts you can't escape me come get me if you can <laughs> yeah this is easily one of my i love the way he did this line i mean when i first heard this at the arcade i would just you know at the demo screen they would just uh play the game over and over and then like sometimes have the sound immediately when i saw this i was like wow this is so dope and plus you know back in those days like hearing even a voice would, was amazing and the fact that he said this line with that uh i guess delivery was just super dope rise from your grave okay it's like how could i not include this line <laughs> on this channel when it's the name of the channel yes rise from your grave i mean come on now that's why it's one of the highest performing numbers because everybody knows this line it's hilarious and honestly i don't think the let's listen to the arcade one rise from your grave it don't it doesn't have a charm you know it's like i don't know it just doesn't have that pizzazz sort of like the uh the welcome to your doom which everybody else loves on this channel let's listen to that real quick Welcome to your doom. And the arcade version of that is just... Welcome to your doom. Yeah, see, it's blah. It doesn't really... I mean, it's not that it's bad. It's just... I don't know. The other one's really better. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoy that. Keep enjoying all these voices. And I might do this a, a few more times. I actually like doing this today. Cool. Peace. <laughs>